Okay, here's a little demo of uh, uploading photos to my newly rethemed uh, Barking Dog Studio, which is uh, my photo site. And the idea is to take advantage of metadata that are in uh, the images that I save uh, through Aperture, etc. But there's information in the images that uh, WordPress uh, can use when displaying. So I'm going to do an ordinary uh, blog post. Um, like is done and then from my uh, desktop uh, I've got a list of pictures I've been saving that I want to uh, put into the mix here so I'm going to just drag and drop that uh, into WordPress uh, image uh, like just uploading uh, images through the media uploader but it's kind of a shortcut uh, there is a thing uh, sometimes my photos have uh, in their title um, some uh, text that I use from Flickr which aren't really part of the um, the title, so I'm just going to shorten that. I'm going to insert it in the post, and then I'm going to uh, put in that title as the title of my post, and that's pretty much it. Uh, I usually add some categories, so this is places. I'm going to add uh, some tags, so I'll say uh, beach, uh, sunset, uh, Mexico. These are all descriptive tags for the photo, and then I'm just going to uh, publish. And so a new thing that I added is uh, because WordPress can get to some of the metadata in the image, and I'll show you how it's displayed on um, when I look at the post, but I'm also grabbing this uh, right over here on the right. You see EXIF tags. So this is all the camera information. It's the exposure, a 30th of a second, uh, the focal length, 4.1 uh, millimeters, the f-stop, the uh, camera device, and even the ISO. So this is all information that WordPress uh, can get from the image. So uh, when I view this post, um, so it's got the title, it's put the picture in there, and then it's got all this information, uh, photo metadata, um, which I did not have to enter, it just pulled it directly. If there had been a caption, some of my photos I have captions uh, in um, the photo itself, this one didn't, it would have put it on top, um, but it put all that information in there. Now what I can do is if I click on camera, this is a link now, and this will show me all the other photos I've uploaded that have been taken um, with my iPhone uh, 6S. So I've uh, connected uh, the metadata from the photos into some of these tags. I can see all my photos that were taken um, at a shutter speed of, uh, looks like I got a little bit of a bug there. It should be 1 30th, uh, not 1 30th. Oh, what a terrible demo. Uh, let's see, that one didn't work. <laughs> so this one, there's still little bugs in the system. Uh, bad screencast. How about the aperture? Let's see if I can find all things that have uh, been taken with an f-stop of 2.2. So all these photos um, have been taken um, with the same aperture. So I'm creating uh, some different ways in which uh, just from the Im information stored in the photo, I can really uh, use that in some useful ways uh, on this uh, WordPress uh, site. There's some other features, but I'll come back to that in a second when I fix my bug. Bye.